Hey guys and welcome, Green Reaper here. We got ourselves another trailer reaction. We got ourselves Marvel Studios The Marvel's teaser trailer. Now I heard you know, I guess Brie Larson had some issues with having so many characters that had been called the Marvels instead of Marvel Captain Marvel 2. I don't know if that's true or not, but you know, just it's like I don't know. I, I Whatever, I guess. I, I, I don't know how to react to that because that's... I don't know if it's true. You know, and if it is true, that's kind of sad. Uh, I go... It's a title. But, yeah, I understand. You know, everybody else is getting Ant-Man 1, Ant-Man, Ant-Man and the Wasp. So, there was no 2. Captain America... There was no 2 for the other ones except Iron Man had 1 and 2 in there. And Iron Man had 3. Like, Iron Man is the only one that had the numbers in their movies and everybody else had... Sub uh, a title and another title underneath their 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 subsequent sequential movie, so yeah, so I don't know that one is kind of iffy on uh, in my opinion. Like you're gonna cry about that, and if if it's true that that's kind of sad. But if not, then why are we start why are we starting rumors already? Why why? But without further ado, you know, for all the new people out there, welcome to my channel. If you like what you see here, hit that. Uh, Subscribe button, hit that bell notification for all of you people who have been here before and have subscribed and had notifications on. Welcome back. Uh, so, as far as the MCU is going, looks like they're going to be let off the gas there a bit and uh, start focusing on less is more and focus, focus on more on the quality of the stuff. Now, Ant Man, I didn't do a review for Ant Man. Um, because I didn't when I I didn't get a chance to film it, and I was like, by the time I'm showing with these other videos that I was that I'm struggling to get out, it was there's no point really. There's really no point to get it up. I I, I just said screw it, I'm done. But I did catch it in that man of the wasp when they're if you watch it at the end when they had the ants marching the enemies away, and the camera's pulling back, they stopped and the camera's still pulling back. They weren't moving. They were static. Hopefully they fixed that scene because that I caught that. I was like, wow, that's a big one. And yes, I was disappointed with Modoc and his story arc and how he looked. That Ant Man Quantumanium was a good movie. On par with Ant Man and the Wasp. Could have been better if Modoc continued being a bad guy and didn't turn into what he turned into. And two, if he didn't look the way he looked. Um Yeah. Those are the two things that would have probably helped improve it a bit more. Um, it was entertaining. wasn't a great movie. wasn't amazing, but it was a it was good. You know, I'm not gonna be like going. Who that? I'm gonna go see it again. No, it was a good movie. It I got entertained, but again, it wasn't high quality Marvel movies that that we, we could have gotten. But yeah, that's my opinion. Uh, let me know what you guys thought about it. Did you guys hate it? Because I know a lot of people hated it completely. But uh, without further ado, let's jump into Marvel Studios the Marvels teaser. Captain Rambo? Oh, what Saber. What are you doing? Entering the jump point perimeter. I'm gonna get you some readings, Fury. Fire. Hello? Monica. Hello? Why would you mess with this? Oh Where's Captain Rambo? What the hell? What the? F what is going on? What the? Hi. We're looking for Kamala Khan. <laughs> okay, so our powers are entangled. I can manipulate light energy. And you, I can totally show you. No! Oh! oh not again! Hi. Where's our daughter? Wherever you were. Jeez. <laughs> Where are T 
team? Oh, no, 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 we're not a team. We're not a team. <gasps> Wow. All right. Uh, it definitely looks like it's going to be a pretty good movie. Definitely going to be fun and entertaining. Uh, so hopefully we'll figure out to explain it. Why it has to be with that wall. And why does Monica have to touch another wall again? Another wall. Why? Why her? Um, but yeah, I, if she didn't touch that wall, this probably wouldn't have. And hopefully they figure this out. But that's it's kind of crazy to see that the... That's how they're going to be. That's how they team up. <laughs> because of whatever Monica did. They, yeah. Uh, don't know who the main villain is going to be for this one. Definitely can't wait to see who the main villain is. But I'm excited to see that Saber's in it. Saber. That's pretty awesome in itself. What will this set up? What are we linking it up to? What's going to be connected to it? Many questions, many questions. Nothing really answered here, but a lot of cool stuff. A lot of things went by pretty quickly, so I didn't catch everything that was in it. But I'm definitely excited to see how this is going to turn out. Uh, yeah, and Brie Larson got really thin for this role. I think she was a pretty good solid weight in the uh, in the last movie. She was really good weight. I don't know why she went skinnier. I have no idea why. Uh, I think she was the way she was in the first Captain Marvel was really solid enough. Muscle and everything else was perfect. Um, so I, I have no idea why she got even slimmer. Uh, let me know what your thoughts about that. Are you Do you like her slimmer? Do you, do you think she looked better in the first one? Uh, but yeah, let me know in the comments below and I'll see you guys around for more. Alright guys, you take care. Bye.